Hi guys! Okay, so as I said in my last video about the Sigma brushes and eyeshadows that I got, I've been traveling a lot lately. Uh, my husband and I went to visit his family up north and I have been to the States actually a couple of times since I last made a video and so traveling means shopping so I have probably a couple of haul videos that I'm gonna do. So as I said I did the Sigma one before and now is gonna kind of be the rest of the stuff I got. So on my trip to the States, my first trip to the States, I got mostly some drugstore stuff. Um, the first things I got were some eyeliners. I'm really terrible with liquid liner. It's just something that I never wore and I'm trying to get into it. And so the first black liquid liner I got, I really didn't like the applicator. It was really difficult to use. It was quite hard. So I picked up this L'Oreal Carbon Black Liner Intense. It's like a felt tip. And if I'll show you the tip. You can see it's really long. And it's super bendy. So it just glides on super smooth. So I do a lot of practicing with this and I've actually been able to wear it out of the house a couple times. So this is helping me with my liquid liner ineptitude. So I got, I also got another liquid liner. Um, it's hard candy from Walmart and it's just a turquoise color. I think it's just called turquoise and it's just got like a little brush applicator, but I've actually been, I'm wearing this one right now. I applied it and it worked. So I'm quite happy with that. Um, and it's really made me, um, fall in love with this sort of all over sweep of shadow and then a bright pop of liquid liner. I'm enjoying that look. So I actually purchased another one, which I'll talk about later. Um, then also at Walmart, I got the hard candy plumping serum volumizing lip gloss. And this color is called girl next door. And it's kind of just a really, really sheer shimmery pink. It actually goes on almost clear. That's a swatch of it. Um, it's a nice lip gloss. It feels nice. It doesn't have like, you know, that kind of like sting burn your lips off kind of thing, but it doesn't make them super plump. It just kind of removes some of the little fine lines. And I put it on, leave it on for a couple minutes and then put my lipstick over top. Anyway, um, then I went to Bath and Body Works and I got, I actually got three of these. Liplicious, tasty lip color. And I don't, the other one I think is in my purse. Um, they all come in these fun little sort of candy or drink like, you know, strawberry daiquiri and stuff. So I got Limeade, which tastes delicious and it's just kind of a shimmery clear gloss. And Saltwater Taffy, which also goes on sheer but it looks sort of purple here. And the last one was, it has actually a tint and it's called Fruit Punch and it's just like a really nice bright melony watermelon color. But like I said, I think it's in my purse and so I don't have it to show you. Um, so. Then the other thing I got on my trip to the States was, it's not makeup, but it's just this uh, cute little clutch. I got this from Target and it was the Target's Liberty of London line and it's got this magnetic closure. So it opens up like this and there's all these little pockets for your cards and there's a little zippered pocket. It's really great. My only thing that kind of drives me crazy about this is in the little clutch part you can see <laughs> that's where the magnets are and all my change sticks to it and my locker key from work and my lipsticks stick to the magnet inside so you're always kind of having to push things down but otherwise it's really awesome I really like it I carry a big purse so if I want to go somewhere and not carry my whole purse around I just grab my little clutch and go in and it's really convenient so that was uh that was everything I got in the States on my first trip. Then we went to visit my husband's family <clears throat> and we had to go through Edmonton to get there and so we went to West Edmonton Mall. So I was able to just pop into Sephora and I just actually picked up a couple of things, just sort of boring things. I got a new Urban Decay Primer Potion. I actually have never had just the regular primer potion before. I bought for our wedding um, the shimmery one. I think it's called Sin. So that's the one I got. And then I picked up, I was wanting to try a new mascara so I picked up these two little samplers of this is called the fresh magic wands collection and it comes with a little sample of fresh supernova right there and fresh firebird and they say you know you can get a really nice customized look by layering them together 
Um, which is kind of nice, but I'm not really a big fan of putting on two mascaras at once. I don't know, that just seems like a lot of work. So the, I'll say the Firebird gives you probably a really natural look, maybe more natural than I would like. Both of them make your lashes feel amazingly soft. It feels like you're not wearing any mascara at all, but the Fresh Supernova, you just get these big sort of doll eyes, one application, doesn't feel like you're wearing anything. It's amazing, I love it. It's my new favorite mascara. So this is what I'm gonna be buying from now on, except I'm gonna buy the big size when I run out. So I'm excited about that. So, um, also on that trip, yeah, I got this NYX um, liquid liner and it's in like a really beautiful like shimmery copper color and I like to layer that with the um, one Sigma eyeshadow, the kind of charcoal colored one. That looks really fun. Like that. And that was everything I got on our trip up north. So then when I got home, my parents were on vacation in the States and so I drove back down to the States to spend a couple days with them. And I got to do a little more shopping. So I actually didn't buy a lot cosmetics wise on that trip. Um, I did buy this Sonia Kashuk brush and it's like a uh, synthetic flat top. It's really dense um, and it's really nice for cream blushes. That's why I bought that one. Very nice brush. I just used it actually for the first time today and I really enjoyed it. Um, and also I got, where is that lipstick? Oh yeah, I got this Revlon lipstick and the color is called Soft Nude. Just a nice peachy kind of nude. Really sort of neutral. Um, goes on a bit thicker than I wanted, but if I put a little lip gloss with it, it kind of thins it out and it's perfect. So then the last thing, oh, I forgot to tell you about that. Also on our trip up north, I was so excited because uh, where my husband's from, they actually have a Sally Beauty, which is hard to come by in Canada. So we, I went to Sally Beauty and I got, uh, with my sister-in-law, and I got this China Glaze nail polish, which I've been looking for. Um, it's called For Audrey, so it is the Tiffany Box blue color, and I love it. And then I also picked up the Sesh Vite Fast Dry Top Coat. Wonderful. Love it. I had been hearing so much about it, and it's awesome. Gives you a super professional manicured look. So Okay, so the last couple things I got, I just got today actually here at home. Um, we were shopping and I picked up a NYX cream blush and the color's called Golden and it's a nice, it looks kind of like a bronze, but it goes on, I'm wearing it right now, goes on quite a bit pinker. I'll just swatch it. Oops, I put it right over my... So that's it right there. Really soft, really blendable. That's what it looks like blend it out. It's got like a little shimmer. I actually just put that on top of that lip gloss I swatched earlier so that would be where some of the shimmer is coming from but it's uh it's quite nice and glowy and then I also picked up a NYX glitter eyeliner in the color lavender which is like you know a nice lavender purpley color but it has like an iridescent glitter in it. Um so that was everything from my big haul and all my shopping trips. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. I hope to be getting more up soon. Okay, thanks. Bye.